Okay, Noe Josie's actually online. So if Noe Josie wants to play at 3077, then I definitely, definitely will play with him. Um, um, okay, so Noe Josie does want to play. So let's play Knight of 3, B3. Okay, Noe Josie, this is going to be serious chess. Let's play E3, C4, uh, D4. I'll take and play, okay. Let's play an end game takes. Okay, I'll just castle. Um, I can play knight d3, I guess. If knight d3, I can just take a6, play rook d1, b5, bishop e2. Bishop b7, um, knight e5 looks solid. Bishop f6 doesn't actually attack the knight. Knight c6. Ah, this is very, very flat though. Um, Take and play bishop. Let's take and play bishop a3. Uh, he's got 94. Bishop a3, 94. Blah. Very blah position. Um. Hmm. Very, very blah. Um. Or whatever. I'll try bishop a3. I'll probably play 94 and then I'll take. No, he goes king f8. Okay, so now I can play. Maybe bishop f3. Try to force an end game. Um. No, it's Sevian. Must be Fabiano or Shanklin. No, this is not. This is not Shanklin. This is not Sevian. Or sorry, were you talking about uh, Noe Josie, or uh, are you talking about? Um, uh, were you talking about a uh, spicy caterpillar? Both. Both is always possible as well. Um, Maybe knight e2 uh, is possible. Go knight d4 next move. It's Ben! Benjamin Feingold! I don't think it's Benjamin Feingold. Um, okay, so what's his next move is, I guess, the first question. I could play rook c1 here. Um, hit the rook in the knight. Ah, he's got king d7, though. Okay, maybe... But maybe knight f4... So I've still got a rook d1 check to hit the king if he ever moves the knight. He also can't move the knight because then I, um, because if he goes knight b7, then I trade the rooks and the bishop on e7 hangs. Okay, g6 logical move. I could always trade and go knight d3. So let's throw in a tickle, rook d1, rook c1. Um, um, I guess I'll go king f1, bishop d6. Let's trade. Um, probably trade with the rook. I'm way up on the clock, though, which is important. That's very important. So I'll trade. Play knight d3, maybe h3. Put all the pawns on light square. There's nothing on dark square. It's e4, obviously. Prevent entries squares here for the black king because the knight covers everything. I'll even pre move king e2. I don't want to play f4 because I permanently fix a pawn here. So let's go uh, king d4. I might play a4 at some point as well. f4, f5 is an issue. Knight e5 maybe to run my king in. Okay, so I provoked a weakness. So. If I play takes here, 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 I'm faster, right? Yes, I'm faster. So if takes, knight e5, takes, takes, king f6, I win. Okay, I could go knight f4, I must take. Okay, let's go king e4. Maybe knight f4, now takes, or knight e6. This is very, very dangerous for black. Um, now if I take, knight c7, takes. Um, okay, let's go king d3. I'm still hitting both pawns. Takes a knight, knight f4. I still hit both pawns here. Now I go knight e4, and this, this must be winning. Um, knight e4, hit the bishop. Uh, 
check. Yeah, now check and I win the bishop. GG, yo. Ain't no rest for the wicked. Okay, round two. We go again. Let's play e5, play solid, knight c6. Um, uh, let's go bishop c5. Let's go d6. Play a5. Uh, I guess we'll play h6, bishop e6 next move. Probably just trade. Um, play a4 maybe. Yeah, let's play a4 so he can't get a4 and knight c4. Maybe just knight h7, knight g5 makes sense here. Knight g5, logical. We'll probably trade. a4 is also important. It stops uh, queen b3 ideas to hit the pawns. H4, I guess queen g6 is fine. Queen g4, I'll just trade. Um, I've got a3, maybe I'll just play b5 here. a3, b4 idea is still looming. Um, doesn't really... Ha I think I'll play, let's see, a3, b4. No, I don't want to do that. Let's play rook b8. Idea to play b4 and a3 now. Although I did give him an f4 break that I shouldn't have given him. Like, he's got f4, maybe. Okay, maybe I'll play rook d8. Idea to play d5. I don't know if I... Yeah, let's go d5. If it takes, I'll just take back. I feel like this pawn structure is favorable with these three pawns. I always have d4. He wants to go knight g4 and put permanent pressure on this pawn. Uh, but d4 should be fine. Knight, knight g4, I will just take... And play rook d6, protect the knight, hit the pawn, rook d8's an idea, rook b8's an idea. Looks pretty good for me. Um, maybe not enough to win, but it definitely is, is quite good. Rook d2. Let's go rook d8. d1, logical. Um, knight a5 is no good. I guess king h7 and g6 is my idea, then h5. And now knight e3, I go knight a5, and now I get the knight to b3, and rook to c6, and now white's very much on the defensive here. Um, f4, maybe just rook c6, hit the pawn on c3. Okay, rook c2, so he's trying to take, I don't quite have b4 here, do I have h4? Maybe, probably not best, um... A, B4? No, that can't be right. Um, I guess I'll just play Rook C5 and Rook E5. So King F3, okay, so I don't really... I'll go Rook F8. Pin the uh, King in this pawn. H4 is... Still a looming idea that I have here. Not sure if I'll play it or not. Okay, it goes d4. Wow. Um, I guess I'll take and play rook c2. I can always play c6 or c5. Um, I guess I'll just play rook d8. Idea to play c5 because of the rook on d1 hanging. And maybe b4, try to run the a pawn down the board long term. Um, if you play this d5, I guess I just take. So I'll... I guess I'll just pre-move take on d5. So I guess I'll play c5. He can't take, so he loses the rook. I've also got lever ideas with b4. c4 doesn't look right. cd4 and knight a5. No, no, I can't go knight a5. What am I thinking? Um. B4. Um, okay, I should actually just move here. I don't have all day. Um, I don't want to take. C4 looks iffy. No, not H4. Um, I guess I'll just play rook C8. If D5, I'll take. Okay, takes. Um, play rook C5. Knight D4, I can always trade. I've also got Knight C1, maybe. Let's go rook C1. 
Rook d6, king f7. I'll maybe uh, throw in a check. Knight d4, now I'm threatening check and the pawn. Uh, maybe just king f6. Uh, just takes. King f7. King g6. Ah, he's got 97. Oh, oh, geez, I just... Ah, am I, am I getting mated here? No, maybe not. Ah, that was so bad. Maybe I had nothing better, though. Maybe at that point it was just a draw. Anyway, next game, let's go e3. Draw is minus two, which is actually kind of nice for a change. Play c4. It could be Dominguez. That's always a possibility. I don't think it is, but it could be Dominguez. Um, let's play h3. If c5, I can just take. Okay, castles. Knight d2. Queen c2. Maybe knight e5 and f4. Let's play b3. If takes, I'll just take with the pawn. And then go f4. It's so... No, I don't think it's Wesley either. Wesley's... Oh, no, it's not so. Wesley's playing. Or it's not so. Yeah, what, because Wesley is playing. Um, Wesley is playing. Uh, Wesley is playing right now. So, I can trade. I can play f4. Yeah, let's just go f4. If f6, I'll take. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da -da -da. Okay, I'll go e4. If takes, knight e4. And then I've got ideas like knight e6, bishop c4, queen c4. So this is pretty good, I think. Knight e4. Uh... Oh, it doesn't, knight f6 doesn't work. Okay, I guess, nah. Hmm. Um. Check knight e6. No, I can't do that. Um, I guess just bishop b2. If takes, I just take back. Queen c7. Um, d5 looks logical. Not the only move here, but um, actually, this is annoying. I guess I'll just... Yeah, I'll just play d5. c5, I can always just play g3. Protect the pawn. Retreat the bishop. Um, maybe just bishop f3. And just king g2, solidify the king and the bishop. Maybe h4, h5 is an idea at some point. If knight g6, uh, maybe just bishop c1, bishop d2. Don't know if it's necessary. I don't know if he's really threatening to sack, but I figure it's better to be safe than sorry. Okay, bishop d2, rook e2, I just take. Rook e2, I just, um, sorry. If rook e2, I just take and go rook f2. Um, queen a6, queen c4 is possible. Rook e2, again, I don't believe it's a... Is this really a move? No. So I'm going to play a4 to prevent b5, c4. Maybe queen c4 next move, rook f2. Okay, he's kind of going sideways here. I feel like he's starting to misplay this a little bit. So I'm going to just play an endgame with uh, two bishops against a bishop and knight. Maybe I could have... Nah, I should have taken with the bishop. Maybe uh, bishop f2 here. And now queen f5. You put the queen on e6, h4, h5 is an idea as well. I blundered knight f8. I'll have bishop g4 now. I guess I'll throw in a check and take. Maybe f5 and queen h4. Or queen d3 also. A little bit tricky here for black. Uh, also got queen h4. Queen 7 queen e6, queen g6, g5, okay, takes, queen d3 must be right, hit the bishop, hit the pawn,
queen e7. I will just take the pawn on f5. I've got bishop e3. I've also got g4. I think g4 must be right. Ah, he's got this too. This takes maybe h4. Queen e5 is an idea. Shoot. Um, let's throw in a check. King f2. He can't trade because I take and go e7. Queen d3, just e7. Okay, I just take. Let's play b4. This takes. And now I'm just going to run the king all the way up. And this queen is dominated by my queen. Um, All right, next game. Let's play knight f6, um, e6. Um, yeah, d5 is fine. Oh, c6 was a bad move, actually. I should have played a5, knight a6 first. Um, am I into watch collecting? No, I do not collect watches. Um, I'll play rook e8, bishop f8. Maybe bishop f5 as well. Um, bishop f5 seems fine. If f3, I can play c5. g4. Okay, I wish... I guess I'll play rook c8 of g4, just, okay, bishop f2. He's trying to force, so now I'll go bishop f8, so there's no e4. Knight f4, I guess I can just take. If queen d4, I've got bishop c5. Okay, now, uh, bishop d6 looks reasonable. Knight g6, a g6. If bishop g3, I can just play knight c7 and knight e6. Knight c7. <laughs> Queen d2. Uh, I can play knight e6 here. I could also play b5, b4. What about b5, b5, g5, b4, knight a4. No, I'll just go knight e6, try to force knights off the board. He's also put the pawns on, on bad squares, so he can never really play f for f4, g5 anymore with this structure. Um, so I'll play Primo Queen takes uh, d6, knight e2. Um, I guess I could also... Um, I don't really want to concede the file, but I don't see anything better. So let's just trade and I'll take and play queen b6. I don't really like conceding the c5 square, but I can always play e5 or knight d7. Black. Uh, e5 is always logical. Knight d7 is a move too. I'll just play knight d7 here. Knight f4. Um, just bishop f7. He, if knight d3 hangs the pawn. Now I could play e5. Um, knight b8, knight c6 actually makes a lot of sense too to hit the pawn on d4. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, knight c6 seems fine. Hit the pawn of f4. I've got bishop h5. I've also got uh, e5 next move to try and open up and put a knight on c4. Yeah, now I'm going to definitely blast. It takes knight e5, knight c4, hit the pawns. Queen here, queen f2. Um, also a threat. Um, could trade. I could also play like 
Uh, what about queen g6 here? If f4, I have knight g4, knight f4, I can just take and go like rook d8. I've also got queen c2 maybe. Thank you, Mr. F Mr. Uh, PH1X, for resubbing two months in a row. Killing it, man. Keep it up. Do I play any instruments? No, I do not play any instruments. I, I have knight d3 here, queen d2. Um, I feel like I should have some tricks here. Knight g4 is trick number one. Uh, queen h5, maybe just knight c4. Hit the pawn on b2, knight e3. Guess just take, why not? If rook c1, I've got knight d3 with the fork on the queen, so he has to go there. Now I just come back. a3 is hanging next move. This is pretty bad for white. Um... I can trade and I guess go uh, queen d6, try to trade the queens. I'm up a pawn on the queen's side. I've got a nice majority. He's also got double g pawns, which bodes very poorly for the end game. Um, knight c4. Knight b2, a free pawn, knight b, okay. I am gonna use my pawns. They are gonna roll down the board really, really fast here. Maybe just, I mean, maybe just b5, why not? Oh, I'm down on the clock here. I didn't realize I'm, I'm actually down on the clock. I didn't realize I'm actually down on the clock. Okay, let's go d4, it takes a3, a2. It should be three, hit the knight. Oh, what am I doing? What on earth am I doing? I'm still winning here, but like, knight b5, a3, a2. Oh my gosh, I'm making this really, really tricky. Um, what am I doing? Yeah, I just win. GG, yo, GG. Moving in. Play knight c3 here. Uh, e4 looks pretty good. Hear my prayer. Play rook e1, bishop f1 after knight f4, rook d1 next move. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give okay, so he wants g4, I guess. Uh, whoa! Thank you, Alexandra Botez, for raiding with a party of. 188. Thank you so much for the raid, Alexandra. Um, I guess I'll play knight e2. If takes, I can take with a bishop. He'll probably go back to g... No, he won. Okay, so he takes. I'll take with a bishop. If g4, just knight d2. Rook a d1. Keep building a nice uh, little compact center here. Um, I think I'll slide back to f1. If g4, just knight d2. And now, also the e-file. He can never play f5 because I take and I hit the queen and the rook. Um, I think I'll play knight d2, maybe. If e5, I'll just go d5. Maybe I'm threatening e5 here. Whoa! Thank you, Alexander, for gifting five subs to the community to Chaos Riggin. Bugsud, 666, Wow, I'm Ed, uh, Sophie TV, and Orca Azure C. Uh, I'll go e5, trade de5 looks pretty good here. If knight d7, I think I've got knight e4, knight e5, knight d6, bishop e5, trade, and knight d6. Hitting the rook and the bishop, so knight e4 is going to be very good. Um, let's play knight to e4. If he takes, I take go bishop d3 and then mate him on h7. Actually, I'll even pre-move queen e4. I'm farming Dominguez's rating. I don't think this is Lenier, actually. Um, okay, I mean, bishop d3 looks strong. He's got to go like rook e8. He wants to go knight f8. I'll throw in a check. Uh, do I go hunting him with h4? Yeah, let's go hunting. Let's go hunting. If takes, I go bishop c1 and bishop takes h6 and queen h8 mate. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Okay, knight b8. I could play bishop b4. I could also take... He wants to go knight c6. I guess I will just... Uh... If I take, is he really going to take with the queen? No, I'll go bishop c1. If knight c6, I think I can take and go like queen h5. Maybe even f4, actually. Okay, let's take... 
Got queen h5. Yeah, queen h5 looks deadly for black. Bishop g5 is extremely strong here. If f6, I think I can take and go bishop g6 even. Black's position is starting to crumble here. Um, really, really ugly position for black. I've even got maybe bishop g5 and queen f3, queen c6 after f6. So I think black's in a world of hurt. Um, what? What? Free exchange? You give me free exchange? I will take the exchange every day. Um, okay, I guess I'll just take and go like queen e2, f4, and g3 next. Um, uh, I know, but I, okay, he wants to go knight d7, knight c5. I see his idea. So I'll play queen d2 so I can play b4. a5, logical. Um, maybe rook b1 and b4 next move. d3, I always have rook d1 and bishop d3. If knight g4, just g3. Or f4. f4 is also playable. Um, but probably just g3 to be safe. Knight d7. Okay, now I will go b4. If takes, queen b4. Knight c5. Okay, I just trade. I mean, he can't get these pawns going, so... This surely is just winning for me. He, he needs e5, e4, but he's never going to get it. I can even just play f3 and g4. Knight c5 doesn't concern me. I'll just drop the bishop back. If he could get e4 in, he would he would have real chances, but he can't get these pawns rolling. Let's go rook f8. Rook okay, a8 maybe. a4, a5. He really needs e5, e4, and he just can't get it. Now, again, I prevent him from ever getting two pass pawns. Maybe rook h8. Rook c8 now. Try to cut the king off even further here. Um, that's rook g8, why not? All right, another one, another one. This song is so weird. It's just a regular song. I'll play knight c6 next move. Um, knight f6. Takes d4, knight e4. Okay, rookie one. Knight d2. Okay, so he's playing extremely solid this game. No risk, uh, no risk, uh, no risk game from uh, Mr. No Way Jose. Play f6, g6, I guess. Maybe queen h5. Just g6 is fine. Uh, cut the diag here. Queen d7. Um, uh, I guess bishop e6 is okay here to prevent c4. Wow, this guy is being super solid. No, uh, not allowing me any chance. I'll even chuck a pawn here. I'm going to chuck a pawn to get activity. And he doesn't bite at all. He just plays h3. Doesn't take and trade and win the pawn. Mr. Josie is not in the mood to have fun tonight, clearly. So, can I play g5? Yeah, I think I can. If I can't play it, I can't play it. But I'm going to go for it. I want to try and win. Um, I made Danny go crazy yesterday. I made Danny go crazy like every day this week. Um... I, I don't want to take a draw. I could play knight d6, knight g7, bishop f5, and make a very flattish draw. I don't want to make a draw, so let's uh, let's have fun. Love you so. Okay, he doesn't he doesn't bite this guy. He doesn't want to bite. Um, guess I'll go knight. Knight d6 maybe, queen d7, or rook e7. He can still sack. Oh, uh, Mr. Josie is not in the mood to have fun tonight. I can tell you guys that much. Um, Actually, I've got some very slight issues. Rook e7 maybe? Let's play rook e7. Um, if takes, I take knight g5, queen f6. I think I'm holding. Uh, but yeah, Mr. Josie is not in the mood to have fun tonight. That much is very, very clear. Um, 
Could have played bishop d7 too. Actually, bishop d7 was a lot safer than this. But if the sack doesn't work here on, on g5, then I'm completely fine. Okay, he does go for it. Okay, um, queen f6. If knight h7, just queen g7. Uh, if bishop h7, just king... Okay, he takes. Okay, now the question is which square is right. I think queen g7... Queen g7 is playable. I'm not sacking. Um... Queen h6 looks best though, just to cut squares, have activity here down the, uh, just have activity on these squares. Okay, queen f6, protect the rook, threaten to move the bishop now. Okay, so he wants me to trade, I'm not going to trade, I'll play, um, I think I'll play king g7, oh no, sorry, I've got to play knight e8, sorry, I've got to protect the, uh, protect the queen, whoops, and not hang the knight. It takes... G4, logical. Um, got one problem, this bishop. Play knight e4. B6 and c5 as well. Hmm. This might be, there might be some issues here for me with these pawns. They are very quick here. Um, let's see if I can create something. Maybe, eh, this is not what I want. Um, oh, I could play knight e4 takes. Let's play knight e4 and... Maybe uh, bishop f7 and bishop g6. If takes, I take and go rook. Uh, okay, I takes. He's going to play f4, I assume. Oh, no, he takes. Okay, now I take, though. And I can't really lose anymore because now he's only got two connected. So after I go bishop g6, with, two con with three connected, he could win easily. With only two connected and the center here... I can't really, I probably can't win this, but I shouldn't be, I shouldn't be losing. These pawns should not be enough to compensate. Okay, let's go. I guess I'll go bishop b1. I think I'll play b5. Fix the pawns. h5, bishop d1. g5, king a6, h6, bishop c2. Yeah, I think I'm winning here, actually, because I fixed the pawns. He's got no breaks here. Oh, don't disconnect me. Oh, no, no, don't disconnect me. Don't, 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 don't disconnect me. I'm still here, right? <laughs> Sweating the bullets. Um, H6, bishop c2, and now I cut the pawns. Actually, maybe I can't win, though. I probably can't win. Okay, um... Or though, wait, I can play bishop f5. Ah, I've got this route. Okay. Ah, no, it doesn't work. Uh, okay, I should just... Bishop e4. Let's go for it. All in, baby. Let's go for the win here. Bishop e4. Okay, no draw, no draw, no draw. GG, yo! GG! No draw! Niet, niet, niet! Let's go again. Um, play b3, bishop b2. Uh oh. Oh, took it to pawn. Play h3 in castles. Oh, I give him knight before. <gasps> okay, he doesn't play knight before, so I'll go a3. Probably knight d2, rook e1, knight e5. Niet, niet. Let's play rook e1. c4 maybe, rook c1. Knight e5 looks fine too. Just take and go knight f3. Let's play f4. If knight c5, bishop b5. Knight f3 next move. Pretty nice position here. Let's go bishop b5, hit the rook. Let's go bishop d4. Oh, I had b4 too, maybe. b4, knight e4. c3. 
Not c4. I'll just drop the, uh... Or no, I think I'll play rook e3 maybe and bishop f1. c8, logical. Um... I guess bishop e2. Just drop my bishop back. b5 doesn't really serve a purpose anymore. I can play b4 and c3. Yeah, let's go b4. He'll play knight e4, obviously. Trade and c3. Solidify the bishop. Queen f1, queen f2. Oh, does he have rook c3? Oh, no. Rook c3, I can just trade and go king h1 and rook c1, rook c7. Oh, I've also got bishop c3 and rook d... Okay, bishop d5. But now I go bishop a6 to hit this rook. And now rook d1, next move. And now it's starting to get messy for black a little bit. Um... I've also got, yeah, bishop b5 and c4 next move. Maybe a4, a5 also. Many levers in the position for me. Um, play bishop a... Oh, no, no, I not bishop... Uh, he wants queen h4? Does he want queen h4? Maybe. Okay, let's just go queen f2. Solidify everything further. No queen h4. Now, I could try bishop... Bishop a4, bishop c2, bishop takes e4. This looks pretty good. And also the pawn in h4 is hanging as well. Although maybe he's got g... No, but g5, f5, f6 looks insane for black. So, um... Let's go f5. G... Okay, take, so I take. But I can trade. I can play rook f1. Even queen g4... Queen g4 trade, hg4, bishop c2 is probably good. Is it good enough to win? I don't know. If I trade, he gets doubles. Bishop c2, g4, e2, gh. No, I don't want to trade queens that way. Rook f1, I don't want to do. Let's play, yeah, let's just go queen g4, take, and bishop c2, and pick off, pick off this, uh, pick off, pick off the, uh, pick off the pawn on, uh, e4. He's also got no g4 to activate the bishop, but stuck behind the pawn on g5 now. Okay, bishop c2 and bishop b4. Oh, I had bishop b6! I had bishop b6. Oh my gosh. Oh no, he'd rook it. Ah, bishop b6 was winning. Oh, I've got to be a little careful. I'll play rook f1. Still, it's a good position, but... Um... Okay, so he gives me the pawn for, for free. Let's play rook f2, protect this bishop. Um, how do I activate this? Maybe just rook e... Oh, I blundered the pawn. Oh, jeez. Okay, bishop f5. Bishop b4, more material takes. Uh, just takes and rook e3, I guess. Or bishop c5. Try to... Maybe not so easy, though. I've got rook b1, I guess, and rook b5. Rook b4. If rook... Now I've got b, c6, c7. GG coming up. Yoy. Uh, oy, yoy, yoy. Oy, yoy, yoy. Oh, what do you got? Okay. G3, King G1, Rook E3, check. Okay, throw in a check. G3, King G1, GG. Tag Bonds says, nice stream. I hope you're having fun. I am having a lot of fun tonight. Things are going pretty well. Um, takes. Oi, 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 oi. 
Oi, oi, oi. Oi, oi, oi. Oi, oi, oi. Um, yeah, let's play this one. Um. This guy's gonna break his phone or something? Nah, this guy's not Dan yet. Th Dan has a special, special tilt mode that nobody else seems to have, I would say. Um, so no, this guy's not gonna break his mouse or anything, I don't think. Lidoscope eyes. I could play bishop f5, bishop g6. Um, he's gonna go bishop c2 and knight e4, obviously. Rook d8 is no good. Um, actually, maybe I can play e4. The e4, knight e4. Yeah, I think I can do it. Let's just play e4. In the sky with diamonds. I can take with the queen or the rook. Rookie four is the attempt to win. Yeah, let's just play rookie four, try to win every game. Uh, I'll play h6, prevent knight g5, so I can slide the queen back to e6. No knight g5. Thank you, Elk, Elk Eric, uh, the 3D, for resubbing four months in a row. Uh, I've got rook d8. Bishop d6 also looks completely realistic. Let's just go bishop d6 and rook e8. Um, no queen d7s. Rook e8. Ah, rookie f Oh, he's got knight c4. Oops. Okay, let's go rook h4. Uh, do I go for hero mode? Is rook h3 hero mode? I also have knight e5. I've got knight e5. Rook h3 is the is here is is uh the hero move. Um, but I think knight e5 is probably just safer. I can play queen c4 maybe, uh, takes knight f3. Yeah, let's go queen c4 here. If uh, check and rook c4 looks good. Oh, um, maybe I should have taken right, o no, then same thing, okay. Lucy in the sky with diamonds. Maybe a5. Bishop e5 is playable. Uh, rook e6. I guess I'll just play rook e6 here. Maybe rook g6 ideas. a4, I could play b5. I could also play... Yeah, I think I'll play c5 now because the rook protects the bishop. No bishop g7 anymore. So takes and takes. With diamonds. Lucy in the sky with diamonds. Okay, rook b1, I can't take. Uh, if I take... I want to try and win, but I've got problems. Let's go b6 here. If a5, I can just take. I don't know. I've got to... Ah. No, a5, b5. Sorry, I'm insane. It's all good. Um. Imagine Bobby Fischer... I think I take because I hit both pawns here. Rook d7, rook f6. Protect the pawn in case he checks, but also hit f3. Now he's got to deal with all kinds of weaknesses here. Now I feel very confident about my position. I could play... Oh wait, can I check? Hit the pawn? Check. Check, check, check. 
What? Now he's going to lose everything. The house is going to collapse. Thank you, Anand Oza, for subscribing with Twitch Prime. Now the whole house is going to collapse. Do I play... I'm going to play super precise chess with Rook F5 and... Um, throw in a check. Rook H4, hit this one. And now the H pawn is fast as well. So everything is really, really nice here. If Rook C5, you lose the C3. Way oh, way oh, way oh. Let's go Rook F3. G5 next move, King H7. Takes. H4. We've got Rook F4, Rook H4. Moss Queen. Play D four ninety two, Bishop D. <laughs> yeah. I'll take and play Queen E two here. Castles. Okay, C five. I'll play uh, C four here. Um. Uh, I'll play A three to box this knight, maybe. And um, let's play rook c1. Okay, rook d1. I got to move a little bit quicker, a little bit too slow right now. Knight d4, obviously. I um, guess I'll take, why not? Got knight c4, maybe? Yeah, let's go knight c4. b3 is a little bit weaker than b6, but he can't go b5. Maybe bishop f6 is an issue. Well, I've got knight b5, knight d6 type ideas. Okay, he goes a6. Um, e4 would be insane to play here. Maybe g... I'll play g3. Idea to play e4 here and kick the knight. Okay, e4 takes bishop d4, knight b3. Okay, I guess... Ugh. Okay, e4 takes... ED5. No, it's no good. Okay, I gotta come up with something. Okay, let's just play Rook B1. 94, just I guess Queen D3. Or Rook C. Ech. Knight e4, queen d3 looks fine, or rook c1 and knight a5. Use way too much time there, way too much time. The rook c1. Maybe I could have put, I should have put the other rook on c1, but whatever. I've still got f3, e4 coming. the knight away not e4 probably uh just rook d1 back maybe e4 next move because now i solidify um i guess i'll go knight d2 this is not i should have put i put the wrong rook on um on c1 there so i've got problems this game this game i've got legitimate problems to deal with so i'll just go bishop a1 Ah, one. Now I'm up on the clock again, which is important. Okay, I take. He's got to take with the knight. I guess just a uh, rook d two. 
This is very sketch. I'm very close to losing here. Knight of five takes, takes. If he doesn't take, I can maybe play g4. Okay, I'll go g4. Solidify the knight, create a square, bishop c3. Um, maybe just king g1. No knight of four tricks, bishop c3, hit the knight. I guess I'll pre-move queen b5 in case. Okay, good g6, knight g3. Rook d1, hit the knight. Threaten to take and trade everything. No, okay, just, just, just play chess. I'm up on the clock here too. I'm way up on the clock. I just gotta move fast. H5, fix the pawns. Oh, shoot, I just blundered. What was that? Come on, come on. Quicker, quicker, quicker. Oh, so long, so long. Moon race. For so long, so long. Hmm, I have misplayed this position quite severely. Um, Ninety seven looks correct. Trade I take. I'm going to take on e three next move, so that he can camp go knight f five. I think that's my intention, but I'm not sure. Ninety two, eh, takes is ugly. Wait. H5 maybe? I'd like to re-maneuver my knight somehow. You know, let's just give him F5. I'm not worried. I'll go King H7. He can't hit this pawn easily. I can always play like Queen E6 or Knight F4. Actually, no, nah, I shouldn't have let him put the knight on F5. That was stupid of me. Let's go D5. Rook D6, protect the, uh, protect the knight here. C6, solidify the center. Um, guess I'll just take. Uh, probably I should... Nah, I've misplayed this. This is terrible. Although, he can't really get to this pawn easily. If I can get like rook f6 and knight f4 or knight e7 and trade the knights, then I'm okay. King h2, logical. Um, now I need to remaneuver this knight. What's a good way to remaneuver this? Um... Knight of four is bold. Ninety seven. I'm gonna play ninety seven. If knight h six, I can just take with the king, or the probably just. Oh no, rook is check. Rook takes is just check. Uh, check. Knight g6, and now I'm just winning. All right, we go again! We go again! Let's play knight f3, b3. Bishop b2, e3. Castles. Um, let's play this line again, queen e2 and uh, c4. 
I guess knight d2, why not? And, oh, we're gonna play the same line. So let's let's go a3, rook c1, rook d1. He'll trade, I'll take. He'll go knight c5, I'll take. He'll go knight c4 again. Or no, I don't have to. Maybe I played g3 right away. Let's play g3 right away to play e4 and hit the knight. Okay, now I can play e4, e5 maybe? Yeah, let's go e4 and e5. Hit the knight, knight c4 next move. Um, knight c4, if b5, I go knight a5, knight c6, and b4. Hit the bishop, hit the rook. You remember our September. I also have knight d6 as well. Not obvious what the best move is here. Knight d6 is, um... Not obvious what the best move is here. Knight d6, oh man, this is hard. I guess I'll go knight a5. Ah, 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 body Say do you remember, body If he takes, I take and go b4 and I win the knight. Okay, I'll play b4. Uh, probably I'll just take. Play h4. Remember. Maybe just bishop d4. Oh, did I just blunder some cheeky bishop takes h4? I might have, but he doesn't see it, so... Let's go bishop e3 if b4. Maybe bishop g5 is an idea. Let's take... Oh, but he's got knight c3. Okay, I'll go back. Prevent, uh, prevent knight c3. Badia. Say do you remember Badia? Um, I guess queen d3 makes sense of b2, just rook b1. I am giving him some weird bishop h4 trick, but I'm not afraid of it. So let's go rook c4, try to trade the rooks. Rook b1 next move. Hit the pawn. And now uh, c6, c7 is coming. And this is just winning. Do you remember? Cloudy day. Bishop a7, force the queens off the board. Badia, do you remember? Badia, in September, Badia, was a cloudy day. Badia, remember Badia. Hit the night. Craigsy says, quit chess, become a singer. Uh, not likely. A5. Threatens A4, A4, B5 ideas. Uh, um, yeah, I think B five is correct here. If takes, I just take takes. FG7, Rook G8? No, this is just losing for white. Doo -doo -doo, boom. Queen H5, just Rook G7, Rook G6. You shall find... Oh! Young! But I'm not that young! Okay, Queen H4, GG.
I could play d5. Bishop e6 must be winning. Um, I just need to not do anything stupid here, and... Uh, maybe I should have taken... Ah. Oh, it'd work out 7, so... Maybe d5? Maybe just... Um, I think maybe just rook b8, put pressure on the pawn. Takes. Those will be cannon stars. Thinks that we could be. We'll be counting stars. I guess I'll throw in a check and play bishop d4. Now I threaten to take the pawn. Um, but I'm not that old. What with the... Ah, uh, bishop g7 is playable. Bishop e5. What about king d7? c5? I could also just... Bishop e5 looks pretty good. Um... What about... No, king d7 looks wrong. Um... Hmm. Isn't it... Uh... No, that's bad. Um... Let's just go bishop e5. I guess I'll just take and go queen g5. Little bit counting stars. Circuit eight, yeah. Okay, rook a8, threat and mate. Oh, he's got... Wait, no, but I've got queen f4. Aha! Aha! Queen takes f b4, queen f4, g f4, rook a1 is a checkmate because the rook cuts the g file. We'll be here. Uh, maybe queen... Queen a5, you go queen a1 looks good. We'll be here. We'll be counting stars. Okay, maybe just queen a1, trade. Just to be safe here. Although maybe... Ah, this isn't... Ah, I'm losing the b-pawn. Shoot. Oh, I misplayed this. Whatever. I'm still up on the clock, so I should be able to win this. Okay, maybe uh, rook g5 to swing the rook. Rook a3, rook b3. This is just winning. G7, next move. All right, you guys. All right, that is 10 in a row. Is that an adoption? I think that's an adoption, right? Is that adoption land? 3200 so there's no way 3200 and an adoption like i can't really i can't really play more 3200 is good 3200 is pretty 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 sweet